Hey guys and welcome to uh just bought Thomas was alone. So I just bought this game and um I'm feeling like I wanna play platformers, so um I bought this game, it's not very hard. I don't wanna play like I wanna be the guy or wanna be the boshi or um I don't know. Uh they lead pixels? No, that's probably easy. V V V V okay, whatever. Uh, I don't wanna play those type of hard games. I wanna play more Easy platformer, so I bought Thomas was alone on Steam. I'll probably get the thingamajig on the description, the um, link on the description. And so uh, this game is pretty weird. I've played it. It was the um, it's important to my gaming life at least because I've been playing in my com brother's computer and I only had a laptop and etcetera etcetera I didn't play very much I just went on Skype do things I just played in PS3 with some games mini games even that my dad bought to PS3 and um, and two uh, played in some played in so game some games like Binding of Isaac in my com and my brother's computers and um, like two years ago probably um, uh, I got my first computer with um, no, not two years ago. One year ago, two years ago. I don't know. I bought my first computer. It's pretty good. And this was the first game I played for myself. It was cracked. The first cracked game I played for myself. Cause yeah, I also cracked kind of. So I uh, just I only recorded while uh, the games I really the games I really buy. Um, let's go to your full volume. What is this? I hope it's not lagging, but it seems to be lagging a lot. Okay, no, it's not, it's not, it's not. There's no graphics thing here or anything. Let's go for a new game. We'll do a full walkthrough of this, probably. The program was a failure. People forget it. It was a massive flop. The, the coder started adding name strings to the house as a joke. Thomas AT2326 12. It wasn't special. It was just an AI in the right place at the right time. So yeah, this is the type of pl platformer that this game is. It's pretty fucking interesting because I didn't hear what he said. But wait, do we have? Um, did he? Did the subtitles work? I don't know. I hope they do. Okay, as you see, this is a pretty interesting uh, platformer. You, what do you have to do in every level? You just have to go here, like this. And uh, that was just to, um, well, tell you how the thing imaging works. Zero two. This is easier, Thomas basically, it's just doing that. Thomas decided to start something for posterity. Okay. The whole alone thing. One thing. Portals, they led somewhere. Portals. They led somewhere. We've yet to work out where. Three. Falling. Thomas was absolutely fantastic at falling. He was almost as good at falling as he was at observing. See, that's the kind of lore that I like. This game, it's, it's, it's always gonna be one of the best games of my fucking life. And it, it is, since the start of my gaming life, it's my favorite, my third favorite game so till now. Thomas couldn't fall past this block. Damn it, think. What if there was some kind of inverted fall? Some way to jump. What's the word? I already knew how to jump, but well. It worked! Thomas had solved the great inverted fall mystery. Sometimes there's some irritating things that you won't play the game just to see what he's saying, and probably you'll finish almost. No, he stops talking, and oh, now I can finish the level. You go to finish, and he starts talking, and you can't hear what he says. That's pretty um, irritating. Let's see if he does that now. No, it doesn't. Let's go to the next level. A big jump. But Thomas noted there was no real danger in missing it. The world didn't want him to fail here. It was pushing him, but gently. See, that's it's awesome. This all seemed a little dangerous. The world was not to be whoa whoa sorry for that because I didn't know I was just waiting for him to say things this all seemed a little dangerous the world was not to be trusted but I'm 
stable, and it seemed to Thomas that it could let him down at any moment. He was Did he finish? No. See? He might even be doing so on purpose. Paranoia. Let's go down to the next level. Down. <laughs> down, you serious? I've been playing too much by New Isaac. Thomas wondered whether the portals were actually taking him anywhere. He felt like he was making progress, but there wasn't really any way to know. He seemed to be moving predominantly up and to the right, which might or might not be important. Did he, did he finish talking? Yes, he did. have been paranoia again, but Thomas could have sworn the world was becoming more complicated. It always seemed to be one step ahead of his skills. It had been designed just for him. He wondered why. Was the world testing him? No, not too obvious. I'm fantastic at this game. No, not really, not really. This, the, this is just a beginning world, a beginning game. Now we can actually die, basically. Something about the boiling, toxic, glowing water intimidated Thomas. He didn't like it. He certainly didn't want to swim in it. See, if you go there, you die. Mental note. Or water, not good to be avoided. Indeed. Gonna say anything else? No, he's not. Oh, that was stupid. This is the first kind of little bit, little hard now. You, you can't die probably, but it's kind of irritating. Thomas, no amount of observation or obsessive note taking could combat that. Whoa, no! See, because of that. God damn it! Now I gotta do everything again. Whoa, where, where are you going? Calm down, little boy. Calm down, cowboy. I'm pretty horrible at this game. Oh, especially in the um, part of the levels. I'm just gonna stay there at least 30 minutes in the whole episode. Thomas had a new theory. The world was ah, god damn it. He could feel himself getting smarter. There was the mental list to consider. Over the minutes and seconds since his spontaneous generation, he'd become a pretty skilled jumper. He was evolving. He just wished he had Let me go up! Come on! You serial? Come on, you serial? Are you stop talking? Are you gonna stop talking? Yeah, you are. You are, you are. Yep, finished chapter zero. I submitted hundreds of bug reports. I thought that was a... Whoa, sorry. What happened? Overlapping scripts, more than AI was bound to be spawned in an environment at some point. Turns out I missed the point. The little error changed everything. Look, Russell. So, as you see, we have another guy. Immediate and deep dislike to the skinny red rectangle. Who the hell did this Thomas think he was? I love this guy's voice. It's just so good. So as you see, we you, we gotta go here and help this guy jump, so he can go here and we can go here. These are more elaborate levels that will be much harder in the future. Chris had been doing fine. He wasn't the highest jumper, but he held his own. He'd even been graceful at times. So yeah, we need uh, Thomas here. Graceful, probably, probably the wrong word, but you know, fine. God, was that skinny little runt leaping about like he owned the place? <laughs> I love this guy's commentary. Whoa! Ah, that was a pretty bad troll. You shouldn't do that. I just finish out with this one and the rest with this one because 
If I'm not wrong, I think the rest is just, yeah, doing this. No jumps or whatsoever. Yeah. So, how we get there, you were asking like this. This is more like it. A glowy white thing. Only Chris could get to it, eh? which of course made it all the more enticing. Eh? What would it do? What new opportunity might this switch open up to him? So, as you see, this is kind of a bit more harder. You get to do this every time. to jump slightly higher than Chris. Seriously, this made the whole switch pressing thing entirely worthwhile. I hope he wasn't saying anything else. Was this good? Because on the surface. So now we have to use the yellow one to help Thomas. Chris, I meant. Well, red seemed fine. Happy to be on so. his little adventure. Whoa, Chris what? couldn't shake the feeling that things had taken a significant turn for the worse since Thomas had joined him. Oh, this... Sure he'd been able I to think this is like... Back his way to ever so slightly higher platforms, but where had that got him? Well, to ever so slightly higher platforms, which was sort of his point. I'm just uh, trying to finish the commentary. Mm -hmm. I love this type of levels. I love this game. It's just so good. Yeah. Chris stared at Thomas with pure hatred. He seemed so very happy at their situation. Friends together, a brave fellowship of quadrilaterals on a quest for greatness. Oh, oh I don't know to yeah. But it was all the obvious observation that Thomas was doing which grated. Every time they saw something vaguely new, Chris would hear a satisfied little hmm from the vaulting idiot. <laughs> he thought the next portal would split them up. If only for a few levels. What did he say? The next portal will split us up. If only for a few levels. Okay, that's kind of interesting. I'll get to play alone, probably. to go here. Oh god, I failed. Wait, what? No, the, oh, oh my god, if we needed Thomas to do that jump, I would just rage out. I love this game. So now we have a yellow one. Yeah, yeah, that's how we do. This was his chance, a moment to shine. This was game day. I love this game. It's kind of... God! I love this game. So yeah, I, I remember this. That was pretty good. Would not do. John needed room to show off his exceptional skills. As it was, he was trapped on the wrong side of these little dot things. Where they come from, anyway? I love doing this with this guy. Ah, I was having too much fun with that. John inhaled the air of the open space, and it smelled of awesome. <laughs> time uh. to flex those muscles, to put his training to use time to show those little dots how it was done. You go, John, you can do it. Okay, let's go then. I love this guy, he's just the best character in the whole game. John decided to press the switch to let the little dots catch up with him. John cared for his new allies. 
You could tell from the sympathetic expression I've practiced in the mirror all these years. Yeah. No problem. We should, like, every time start playing with the cube instead of the red one because we'll probably need the red one to help the cube. And that was totally retarded. I don't know how I died there. See the such as now we need him. Come on, Thomas. Oh god. Come on, Thomas. I'm going, Mom. No, I'm just kidding. Come on, are you serious? I'm not ever so slightly. What I'm talking about. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. I love this game, just so good. Lore platformers are just so good. Yes, there he is. How do we do this now? Come on, yellow, come here. Like a boss. Not like a boss, because these levels are super easy, but well, I took too much in there. How do we do this now? Oh, I know. Come on. Yellow, you don't need help. You're yellow. Oh my god, John needs help for once in a while. From both? That's... That's almost stupid. John was happy to keep helping. He felt it was important to his image that he was seen to help the little guys. Okay, I think we need John there, so, um... Because of now. <coughs> Sorry. And thank you also. Wait, what? I'll be. What? Let me. No, that. That doesn't work. How do we do this? Oh my god, I'm finally stuck. Oh my god. Whoa. I don't know. <laughs> I sincerely don't know. What about like... Oh, I, I know now, I know now. I know now. Nigga, I know now. Like this. Now, oh, I forgot he can't. This is true. God damn it! Then how do we do this? Should we just? No, that doesn't. Oh my God! I'm stuck. Are you kidding me? That early in the game? Oh God! Oh god, I hate platformers. I truly do. How do you do this? This is impossible. Nah, no, they, they, they just, just couldn't, can't be impossible. Wait, what? What if we do like? No. Ah, oh, god damn it! You kidding me? What if? What if what? God. God damn it! Like, I don't know! God! Oh, you know what? Ah. Ah, I'm stuck! Oh my god, what if we... What if we like... I just... 
I just don't know anymore. I don't know anymore! <laughs>